Hi guys, uh, and welcome to this tutorial. Um, no, I'm not gonna do that. Mm, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, in this tutorial, I'm gonna do two things. Uh, at first, I'm gonna do a real quick tutorial on how to make a 3D text. It's really simple. Everyone can do that. Uh, and if you don't know how to do that, just watch. And after that, I'm gonna do some more. I'm gonna add. Not a background, but I'm going to add some lights, and, or maybe just one light and some reflection uh, to make uh, a cool looking uh, 3D text that you can use as a photo. And in the next tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to make a simple intro and maybe some more advanced uh, uh, intros and tutorials uh, later. But now, just a simple one. And I have already up my Cinema 4D saving some time so here it is so if you don't want to open it open it and just pause this and we'll continue yes um so here we are You're the fir first thing you want to do is you want to add a text so you go to this free end button and drag it down to text and that should open so uh, you can look it that way or you can move I like to move it in the front uh, or I actually don't, but I'm gonna do it now. And uh, what I'm gonna write is I'm gonna write like tutorial. No, uh, no, maybe not. I'm, I'm just gonna write uh, X crazy designs. And I'm gonna use a cool font. Maybe I'm gonna use that one. Or, uh, or maybe someone that makes a 3D. Okay, I'm just gonna use that one. Yeah, that's pretty easy font. It's not hard. Uh, it's, no, it's not too much. Or anything, so. Yeah. So this is it. And, and now you want to make the 3D. You just go up to this little square or cube with a bigger cube inside of it. Click it, hold, and drag it over, extrude nerves, and drop it. So after that, you go down to text, and you draw, see this arrow pointing to the left. Drag it over, through nerves, and arrow is pointing down. What you're gonna do then is you're gonna drop, and this makes a group. So you can do this or this. So as you can see now, it's 3D. But to make it more 3D-ish, you wanna go to extrude nerves, click it, and make 50. 50 and enter, enter, and the, what it did then was make it just bigger, make it more 3D. Yes, and so what you're gonna do then is really easy. Um, or actually, this is a 3D text. So now it's the more advanced part. Even if, even if it's not advanced, just if you don't want to learn how to make like uh, shadows and things like that and with reflection just leave the video and we continue now so for you other guys that want to learn this what are you going to do is you maybe want a color so uh, I'm just going to make a easy color just make it a blue I like blue like that I'm going to add some transparency 20% and some reflection 20% and the speckler is already on and it'll look a little plastic I like that now uh, what's up with my color and choose a color like that and then I'm gonna go down to glow and I'm gonna turn the glow on but I'm not gonna have some inner strength like that and it's just gonna be a glow outside like that so, mm, you're gonna close that, and you're gonna drag this over extra nerves, and you see this arrow pointing down again, and you drop it. Now, it's colored. So if I render this, it's cover. Right? It's colored. So, but we're not gonna do that yet. We we want to add a floor. Floor. There's this lighting button and floor. And so, and I have to move my text. Sorry about that. I have to move my text a bit up. 
Put my text big job, maybe like that. That's because of the Y here. So um so for the reflection part you doesn't want these layers actually, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Just do a, you can learn it. So and you wanna add a light, just a single light. And it's gonna pop up out there and you see it going dark. That's because the auto light is not on anymore. So you have to drag it out that maybe like that. Mm, that like that. And you wanna take this green up and like that, I don't know. And Maybe try to face this a bit more on your text. Maybe like that. Yeah, and after that, you want to press light. One at shadow maps soft. And then uh, I'm just gonna move it back there. And I'm gonna press this button over here. It's a quick render, and if it's not quick, I'm gonna speed it up. I can't tell you what it really is. I can only tell you what it feels like. And right now it's a still night in my windpipe. I can't breathe, but I still fight. Well, I can fight as long as the wrong feels right. It's like I'm in. Yes, and here we go. You got it, X Cray. Here you got it, X Crazy. Des X Crazy Designs with shadows. Pretty cool. And just a little glow, fancy little shit. Okay, uh, but now I'm gonna do if, uh, another way. If you don't want this glow thing, no, sorry, you're gonna live with this glow thing. Uh, if you don't want these shadows, you want like reflection instead. Uh, you can still have the shadow on; it doesn't matter. But what you can do is gonna add the material. You can click. And you're gonna go to color and take it almost black. Yeah, a bit gray. And you're not gonna add transparency, you're just gonna add a reflection. Take for example 60%. You have to learn that yourself and you don't want a specular. So you're gonna turn that up and you're gonna exit and drag it to floor. Arrow pointing down again, drop it, and boom, the floor went darker. And now, if you're under it, I'm gonna speed it up if it's slow. Hope it's not. Yeah, that was a bit slow, so I sped it up. And here we go. This is an awesome. Uh, 3D text with reflection and shadows and if you want uh, so as you can see this is the text and here you got a reflection and then again the shadows so it looks pretty cool and uh, if you want to save this you can just take a you know, render view or render to picture viewer and it will render here for you this was really quick and after th you're done with that you can Save as a still image. Now you can take J I'm just JPEG, 8 bits, just OK, and here you can save it. 3D text uh, 0001 save. So, here we go. That was the tutorial for today. I hope you learned something new, and if you didn't, that's OK. I'm going to add some new tutorials later, and I'll see you next time. Bye.